Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today there is a new solo challenge called Beastin' with Bo. Uh, it gives you 1,000 coins and a Frozen Tundra pack. Uh, it gives you one Frozen Tundra collectible, which kind of sucks, because it's one Frozen Tundra. I really would have wished that they would have done a gift, so you could get a gift or like a Frozen Tundra. That would have been nice, but of course not. And... The team of the week came out. I'll go over that uh, to uh, in another video, but that one doesn't give you one, which is kind of lame. But I guess that's fine. And I wish they would make they would have made the second one give you something, because then I would have had a reason to play. I don't even know if I'm gonna do. I guess I'll do the Beaston with Bo because at worst I can sell those Frozen Tundra collectibles for a couple couple thousand, like seven or eight thousand. So not terrible. Uh, but also, there are Game Changer packs. I'm going to try my best. Uh, I don't know. I'm trying to think whether or not I want to spend it. Uh, but I might try to get this 8-pack Game Changer bundle. Because it guarantees an Elite Team of the Week player. But my thinking is, these are live until Christmas. Like, I don't get why they're live till Christmas. Because on Christmas... No, no stores are open, so unless your parents buy you Microsoft points or Microsoft money, virtual currency, then you can't even buy this on Christmas because no store around me is probably going to be open. Maybe one of the grocery stores, but it had to be a certain – it's got to be like Walmart or Meyer. It can't be some of the other ones because I don't sell Microsoft money, but I, I don't know. I might go out on Christmas depending because my uncle usually gets me uh, – I don't know, it's been going up. Maybe it's usually $100, but he said this year was going to be special for some reason. Um, he lives in Texas, so he hooks me up. He's got, like, season tickets to TCU, and he used to have season tickets to the Cowboys, but he sold them for, like, this crazy price to this guy. So he, we used to go to those, but I go down there about once a year to a game. I uh, didn't actually make it down there this year, but I'm going to go back. I was hoping maybe to go to the college football playoffs, but didn't manage to do that. But let's get back on topic. He usually gives me a $100 Visa card. Uh, he usually gives me and my cousins and whatnot $100 Visa cards. But I think he might be doing $150 this year Visa cards. Uh, so I'll probably spend that on Ultimate Team. Uh, just kind of uh, like the gift from him to me to you guys because... I think I might just spend it on Ultimate Team, uh, and that might be the end of my spending, because once I get Mutt Master, I'm going to have a million coins, so I don't know how many coins I'm going to need anymore. I'm going to have I'm gonna have my team and a million coins, so uh, it's not like I'm going to get Mutt Master and then spend all my coins on players, but I am going to spend half of it on Charles Woodson, so I don't know. I don't know. But uh, I will try my best maybe to go out on Christmas and buy some money and we'll see uh but i hope you guys and because uh, for some reason xbox won't let me add a credit card to my account anymore i don't get it like i had a credit card that was dead on there for like like two years and then i called in and i had them remove it because it wouldn't let me it just kept saying because it was tied to my renew renewal of my xbox live membership uh so i had to have them remove it and then now it won't let me add a credit card so that's annoying so I actually have to go to the store every time I want to buy crap on Ultimate Team. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. Let me know if you're going to be getting uh, either some of these Game Changer packs or if you're going to get a Game Changer bundle. And I will catch you all in my next video. Peace out, guys.